90 Day Fiancé Happily Ever After star Michael Alessandri's true intentions could endanger Angela Deem's beloved grandchildren, whom he professes to care deeply for. The 34-year-old Lagos native initially connected with Angela, 56, through a Facebook message, sparking a relationship fraught with Angela's insecurities about his potential to leave her for a younger woman. Their tumultuous relationship frequently erupted into loud arguments over Michael's secrecy and alleged motives regarding a green card. Despite these challenges, Angela remained determined to marry Michael and bring him to the United States. Angela Deem, who resides in Hazelhurst, cares for all six of her grandchildren under her roof. Her daughter Scotty Deem is the mother of three of them, while the other three belong to her daughter Skyla Deem. Scotty was featured in earlier episodes of Angela's Journey, but after facing legal issues and imprisonment related to child molestation, Angela seems to focus primarily on her relationship with Skyla on the show. Skyla played a significant role when Michael expressed his desire to have a child with Angela. Despite Angela's urging, Skyla firmly declined to act as a surrogate for her and Michael. How Angela's grandkids welcomed Papa Michael home. Skyla wasn't happy when she saw Michael in her house in the episode, since Angela was accusing him of running an immigration scam just a few days ago. The kids were sure that Michael was going to be with them to celebrate a family Christmas. They all screamed with joy when they opened the door to Michael. It was almost like meeting Santa Claus for the kids. They cried and dibbled and hugged their Papa Michael and thanked their Mima. They cheered and called him the best Papa. Michael told the cameras, he was so happy to see every one of them. When Michael first started talking to Angela, the children were still quite young. Seeing them again after nearly a decade was a surreal experience for him. He was determined to win over Skyla, driven by his genuine love for Angela and his commitment to being in America for sincere reasons. Michael brought gifts for each of the children, who delighted in their emoji slippers. Even Skyla received a present, though she found it awkward to witness Angela acting as if everything was normal, especially considering the recent turmoil in the Ivory Coast. Michael went missing from Angela's house in two months. In December 2023, Michael arrived in the U.S. to be with Angela. However, by February 2024, he had left her. Angela shocked fans when she announced on February 26, 2024, that Michael had disappeared on the 23rd. During this time, Michael had been home caring for the grandchildren while Angela went out to buy groceries and cigarettes. According to reports from 90 Day Fiancé News and Memes, Angela had a habit of locking the doors and windows when she left the house out of fear that Michael might leave her. Unfortunately, on that particular day, she forgot to lock up up before rushing out, leaving behind Michael's belongings, such as his clothes, phone, and passport. Michael is spending time with his new family in Texas. Six months after his disappearance, Michael remains in the U.S. Recent updates show him actively celebrating the 4th of July weekend in Texas. Through his Instagram stories, Michael shared photos and videos enjoying food, fireworks, and playing soccer with friends. It's clear he has chosen not to disclose his whereabouts to Angela informing the police only that he is safe. It appears that since his departure, the 90-day fiancé, happily ever after, Starr has had no contact with Angela or the beloved grandchildren he once cherished.